to uh, come forth and, uh, and speak to us. And uh, we'll recognize our usual um, three minutes. Uh, we do have a rule where if somebody would like to speak uh, for five minutes and has uh, four other supporters with them, we'll recognize them for a five minute period of time. Uh, and, we, and, we may, and we may have that uh, rule being invoked this evening, I am guessing. Um, so, so welcome uh, to our first speakers. Are you uh, ready to go? Or, yeah. We are. Okay. <laughs> Jennifer Anderson, Davis Ace. Okay. Jason Tarmino, Global Banker. Okay. We're and here. We're here representing a number of property owners that are here tonight, and would like to combine some of our time together to one. Okay. I'd like to introduce a number of people to you, represented by this map of property owners, and okay. uh, they are. The uh, Yeoman, the uh, uh, Mr. Henderson, Mr. Winger, Mr. Brimley down front here. We also have uh, representing Melina, the uh, Roger Smith, and I believe Mr. Dowling's in the house, and could they have a few more? So we have a large number of people here tonight. We want to follow up from our presentation to you a few weeks ago at the uh, council meeting when we talked about parking, and I want to hand out something. Jason's going to make a few comments, and uh, We'd and what is the your support. thank you, Jennifer? So we have Jennifer Anderson, Jason Termino, uh, and and what's your time request for for this? Three more minutes. Okay, so so six, approximately six total. Yes. Okay, that's, so uh, that's just fine. We were here only a few weeks ago, and we were saying no at that time. So we've come back with some yeses. To we've had several meetings. Uh, we think that we've got great momentum going. And what we've just passed out, which will be available, is 12 items that we would like you all to act on uh, in the coming weeks. Uh, and then five additional items um, that are sort of structured from a, between now and six months from now, and then six months uh, from now and beyond. Um, and I, I'm going to read a few because I think they're important. First of all, that we think we need to increase the supply by adding X permit parking in North Davis and east of the railroad tracks. Uh, would also like to see a major push to have employers be responsible for providing parking permits to their employees, and it should be their responsibility to do that so that we get more employees parking, not in front of the businesses, but a couple blocks away. Um, we, w we want an in lieu fee for parking to be established. We're recommending $15,000. Uh, and in the coming weeks, um, or I should say in the past few weeks, we've gotten great support from Mike Webb and um, from Rob. Uh, and we would like a little bit more time from some of the other staff members, I think, so that we can go through these first 12 items quickly and figure out with their expertise what we can do now. And would frankly like to be back here in two or three weeks uh, and ask you all to, to make some votes and, and put some priorities in different spaces. We, uh, we need more specifics, and that's where we need the help from staff, and that's what we're asking for tonight. We realize you can't make a decision or comments tonight, so we hope that these notes will be helpful to you and you can get back to us. Thank you. Very good. Uh, and I, I, I take it that it we'll, um, we'll fold this into our long-range calendar discussion about how this uh, fits into staff work and future reports coming back to us. There we are. Okay. Property owners are like a downtown business, and we are going to make it successful. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.